no kidding, that area we just passed, it had all those utility trucks and all those cables and wires and yep. there used to be those horses back there in that pasture, but something's changing. Yep. They get ready to put cable now. Put cable down for a reason. I would imagine they're probably going to be building something. You know, things change. So. Just like I was telling somebody I was talking to earlier today. You know, things change whether people want them to or not. And a lot of people uh, get caught up. Don't want to make change. I guess it's just the nature of people not to make change. Yeah, <laughs> remember when you used to look on television and they had those other old phone single uh, single party lines, like on uh, like on, uh, on Lassie. Andy. Was it Lassie? Yeah, Lassie, Lassie. Timmy and Lassie. Yeah, yeah. and they crank the phone and stuff. Yeah, and then to have other people be on the line so they couldn't make a call. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah. And when we looked at that, like, and we had our tin cans and string. You know, remember? Yeah, yeah I remember that, that as a kid. A yeah. hole in the tin can and talk. And uh, remember, we used to have those um, those um, phones where you dial when you're gonna call somebody. And, uh, they would sit on the desktop or around the counter at home. Uh, they were really heavy and black. Didn't you just mention that? No, 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 no. The phone we were talking about, you had the crank was on the wall. But you just mentioned too about the phone dialing. You no, but, that. but I'm going back and I'm talking about the ones that was black, and we went from the ones that was black to getting the princess phone. There was a princess phone, then there was a little French te telephone. Yeah, but the, yeah. but the princess phones were all different colors. That was the phone. Yeah, like white, blue, <laughs> pink, yellow. Which those what colors it? you were not interested you know. in, but your sisters were, I'm sure. I always yeah. wanted, I was saying, you know, to my mom, I said, you know, we, we need to get one of us now. Nah, what we got is good enough. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> bottom line was, uh, it didn't, you know, until we got a certain age, it really didn't matter anyway, because we weren't really into talking on the phone. Now, I remember, you know, because we got up in middle school and in high school, then you had friends you get on get on the phone have a conversation with or oh, I remember my sisters they because we'd have to get in line to see who's going to use the phone. Yeah, that was four of y'all. And you'd only get so much. Actually, it was only three of us because Vivian, even though she was the fourth one, she was so much younger than us um, that it really didn't matter because she wasn't really interested in the phone. Yeah. I remember Carolyn would be on the phone talking to somebody or Maybe I wanted to get on the phone and talk to somebody else. And then Pat would talk. And then when she got up in high school, you know, and my sisters were dating and, and I was dating and everything else. And you were talking to the person, you know. they get on the phone, listen to, to the guys breathe, or i get on. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully you weren't listening to the guys breathe and that's like, is this no. what you tell me? Man, we used After to get 40 on. years of marriage, you listen to guys breathing on the phone. Oh, that was mm. back when 45s, too. See, it was cool. You get on the phone, oh you get the right 45 <laughs> together, and you just play that little 45. That would lead into the discussion. I don't want to even talk about your past dating yeah. experience. I didn't say anything about dating. I was just talking about discussion. Uh -huh. But anyway, yeah, you know, when you think about that, and I remember the princess phones got to the point where they would light up. Mm -hmm. so you could see the keys at night. Push the button. Yeah. Uh-oh, push the button. That's yeah. an old phrase, isn't it? Yeah, we started pushing the button really early. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But you, but you know what? What? Stop and think at the time that cell phones came along. Remember, we used to even have one, you know, in the bag, a big, heavy clunker. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I, you know, we used to look at James Bond pictures and you'd see him with those big phones in the, in the car and it's like, oh man, this dude, uh, he got all kind of money. You know, when you're up in class and you're rich, you can do those things. Yeah. But, Me and James Bond. But everybody.
everybody's got access to a phone now, or should, yeah. or know somebody who, who should. Uh, but it's not a necessity to live, but it makes things a lot easier. I guess that's where you talk about technology changing all those wires that we're putting in the ground. And yeah. I don't know what's going on because, like I said, it was like a little place where they had horses and then now it, it, it was like a fruit garden and it was just vacant for a while and now all these utility trucks rolling in there and nobody asked them permission to do that they did what they had to do somebody made a decision on some corporate level and they rolled on in there and they started making changes oh did you see the one dude who went past there he eyeballed the donut sign on our truck better than donuts.com he, <laughs> he like stared like because we were the truck was like in front of us and, and he thought uh, we were coming to make the sale. Said, well, hey, hey, dude, we ain't got no donuts for you, but we got some travel for you. You know, it's more than travel, though, now. And like Lorenzo was saying on his call this morning, um, hey, we got to change our language. We got to change how we, we're literally reinventing ourselves. Because